An African patient is presented to your clinic with complaints of severe abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, and four episodes of diarrhea with bleeding. Which of the following treatment protocol is not suitable for this patient? African patients so don't think that this is a case of, of the traveler's diarrhea where you can give lopramide, right? Remember here how you are going to start the treatment. First of all, say a four episodes of diarrhea with bleeding, nausea, vomiting also. So fluid loss is there. So yes, you can start the patient on IV fluid. You have to give the injection of the pantoprazole and ondansetron. Fine. You are going to add one metronidazole, one antibiotic also. The question is, which should not be done? Not suitable. Lopramide answer is C. Why lopramide is not suitable? Can you answer me? First of all, you tell me what is the mechanism of action of lopramide? This is mu agonist. When any patient who is having watery diarrhea, secretory diarrhea, like at that time, see here, whenever you give lopramide, now what it will be doing? So this will be, so this will be inducing the movement of the contraction in large intestine. And because of lock and block method, it is going to block the outflow of a stool here. Right? Remember here, in this case, patient is having bleeding also. Bleeding also. So, because of lopramide, there will be a spasmodic contraction in the intestine. A spasmodic contraction. If patient is having bleeding, any patient who is having rectal bleeding, in a case of inflammatory bowel disease, remember here, any condition, whenever you see bleeding out of rectum, no, then please don't give lopramide. Because it will be inducing what? A spasmodic contraction because of that more and more bleeding. It can damage more. So, answer will be C.